Express Scribe Transcription Software Overview. To transcribe a recording, drag and drop your audio file into the dictation panel. You can also use the load button on the toolbar to navigate to the audio or video file. Highlight the file in the dictation panel, then press F9 or click play at the bottom of the screen to listen to the dictation. This is an audio of a sample dictation. Use the notes field to type the transcription. The other playback controls are the stop button or F4. Go to start or control plus home, rewind or F7, fast forward or F8, and go to end or control plus end. Immediately above these controls, there is a slider that shows the playback position in the recording. You can slide this control to move the playback position. Next to this control, the playback position time is shown. There are also sliders for setting the playback volume and adjusting the playback speed. The volume of the recording is shown in the dB meter. Once you have completed the transcription, you can click the Done button on the toolbar to mark the recording as done and move it from the dictation list. Across the top of Express Scribe is the menu bar. Clicking on a menu opens a list from which you can select an action. The shortcut for each action is shown alongside it in the list. Just below the menu bar is the toolbar. These buttons provide fast access to some actions. If Express Scribe is not displayed as full screen, some of the toolbar buttons may be hidden. Clicking the double arrow head on the right hand end of the toolbar will show the missing buttons in a drop down list. The secondary toolbar provides quick access to actions related to the dictation list such as save, delete, and recover all dictations. The section under the dictation list is where you can enter, edit, and delete notes saved with the recording selected in the dictation list. To add a foot pedal, open the options and go to the control tab, then run the control setup wizard. To easily work with a word processor, such as Microsoft Word, Express Scribe can be put into a mini mode in which only the audio controls are available. Do this by clicking the Scribe Mini button on the toolbar or pressing the Ctrl plus M keys. You can exit this mode by clicking the Hide Scribe Mini button or Ctrl plus M again. Express Scribe can automatically download recordings for transcription by clicking the Sync button on the toolbar if it has been set up. You can set up Sync on the incoming tab of the Options menu. Set up the Speech to Text tool on the Speech to Text tab of Options. You can set up user specific profiles of frequent clients to improve the quality of the draft transcription that is created. After you have enabled speech recognition, Click Speech to Text on the toolbar to produce a draft transcription of a dictation recording. For more ExpressScribe tutorials, visit the address shown on your screen.